Mayfield Dairy is hosting story time at their visitor center in Athens. It's free and it's open to kids of all ages. Hopefully kids my age. <laughs> 10 News anchor Sam Perez joining us live. Sam, what fun are you guys getting into? Yeah, Robin, it is so much fun here. You can see there are still some kiddos ordering ice cream, but many of them have filed inside the theater behind me because they're getting ready for that story time with Maggie. Now, let me show you a little bit about all the fun that Mayfield Dairy has to offer. So right now we're headed into their ice cream parlor. So they have over 35 different flavors and that is for you to choose from. Now you can also get milkshakes and that can be made with either white or chocolate milk and over here you can see their ice cream selections their list again over 35 different flavors now I was talking to some of the employees here who tell me that they buy everything all of the milk from local dairy farmers and it takes 20,000 cows milked twice a day in order to make all of the milk that uh, they have here at the plant. So now I'm joined with Donna Ballou. Donna is with Mayfield Dairy Farms and you're responsible for helping put on some of the events like Storytime with Maggie. So first off, can you just tell me a little bit about Storytime with Maggie and all the fun that's happening today? Well, we have uh, author Sarah here and she is, she has Moo Moo Nap Nap, which is one of her new books. So we have her here, we have Maggie our famous cow. Yes. Uh, and kids are getting milk and uh, excuse me, milk and cookies. And then she's reading the book and we're just having a lot of fun. Amazing. And this isn't the only time that kids can come. You also have field trips and you tell me that they're starting to ramp up right around the end of September. Right. Uh, we start seeing uh, school groups come in. The kids love going on the tour, seeing how the ice cream is made, the yellow jugs are made. So we just stay really busy. Amazing, a lot of fun here, and I'll show you some of that fun coming up later on in the show, and we'll also get to talk to local author Sarah Philpott. So for now, Robin, I'll send it back to you. We will see you shortly, Sam. Thank you.